And a dodged bullet by Magnus. In a different game, in a different match, perhaps a car would go for it, but he doesn't need to take a risk. He's up three points. It's at eight to five, but Magnus Carlsen gets the white pieces, and we have another Catalan. Another Catalan, another A4 system, and I think that was a really big result, Robert. Even though it wasn't a win, that was one of the biggest games of the match. Magnus loses that one. Like I said, it's back to a four-point lead. I think he's played a couple confidence-boosting games thus far, but can he make the most of the white pieces? That defense was unbelievable, right? He just it gives up the F-pawn and then makes it look easy from there. So a great job from Magnus. He's getting this position again. We keep seeing this opening played. Mm -hmm. And this time there's a knight on B4 and the dark square bishop remains for white. It does indeed. And have we had a slight deviation from the 5 plus 1? I feel like they haven't had this exact position. They've had this exact structure. The rook usually comes to D8. We know the drill by now, don't we? Yeah, the bishop on f4 is gone for that knight on b4. So uh, it is a different position. More pieces remain. And that should be good news for white because black is a bit cramped. And h4 by uh, Magnus using tactics to defend the pawn. And the bishop will drop back to e3, pinning the rook to the queen. And queen a6. So if you trade queens, the knight goes back. And look at this, knight c4, bishop c7. You might just win a pawn. Not quite yet, though. The knight defending that square. But at the moment it oh, moves, you are leaning into c7. <laughs> no, no I, just, I got you. I got you. I got you. I That's hung what you the piece there. Yeah, but, you know, it's my rule as a commentator. You always have to be willing to be incorrect. Uh -huh. I blundered a piece. It happens. But no, bishop c7 would be great except for the... Oh, no way! Oh, my gosh! Oh, my gosh! Are you kidding me? I think I should apologize to Magnus. Am I I is this a dream? If it is, Hikaru never wants to wake up. Did that you just do what I thought you just did? That is the ultimate commentator's curse. I don't I think, think I, I have ever seen a call like this. I think I should retire. I think Magnus probably prefers that.